Hey folks, Steve Schrader here. Today we're going to talk about belt changes on a Vortec or Paxton supercharged Coyote Mustang from say 15 to 19 model years. Uh, they are over-engineered beyond belief and they are fantastic design, but one of the problems is, is it causes the belts to be very difficult to get off. So today I'm going to show you how to modify the blower bracket so that you can get the belt change done quickly. So if you're sitting on the side of the road or if you're at the track and you need to change a belt quick between rounds, you can without having to pull your hair out or start cussing out Brian Ellis at Vortec. Sorry, Brian. All right, so let's take a look at the Vortec and Paxton blower bracket. It is a beautifully machined bracket. It has these solid steel plates, two of them held together with all these dowel spacers and pulleys in between. So although it is a beautiful design, it is a little bit over-engineered. I'm going to show you why. So on this side, we'll start with the easy one. There's one, two, three, four mounting holes just to hold this one side together. Well, the problem comes in that the belt goes on one side of this spacer and then the other side of the belt comes out underneath the spacer. So every time you have to change a belt, which hopefully is not very often, but occasionally it happens, this spacer has to come out. Well, anytime you need to get one of these out of there, you have to loosen up all these other ones on the side just to make this spacer loose enough to pull out. So step one, you can ditch this guy. You don't even need him. You can choose to just leave him out altogether and just take him out. And that's a little bit tight right there as it is now. Okay, so there, and then if you have an eight rib, it has this extra spacer on top of that. So you don't have to worry about taking that out and putting it back in every time. There's still more than enough strength over here to hold all this together. Now, the bigger problem, this is the one that will really make you want to just shoot somebody. This bolt here, which is the pulley tensioning system, there's a, um, there's a ribbed pulley back here. And this is used for, you can change the tension on the belt um, to these different slider holes so that you don't have to go get a new belt every time you want to change the size. Anyway, the problem here is the belt goes around that pulley. So guess what? You gotta take this sucker out of there every single time you wanna change a belt. Getting it out's not that bad, but getting it back in is very frustrating, especially uh, when it's in the car and you're sitting on the side of the road or at the racetrack and it's scalding hot underneath there and you're just cussing up a storm. Anyway, the fix for that is, I'll take this bolt out of here, get this belt out of the way. Slide all that out of there. We're going to replace this spacer, get rid of him altogether. You still got your little spacer in the back. That's the little alignment dowel that holds it all together in the back side. We're going to use this bolt to hold it in instead of a spacer. That way, when it's in the pulley assembly, so I can get a picture here, you don't have to worry about the belt being in the way. Now you can just slide the belt in and off the pulley without dealing with that spacer coming out every time. So here it is with it installed. The pulley is on there with its little bolt. There's no longer anything going through the front holes because it's back here. And you can still move this bolt to slide it back and forth in the holes on the back bracket if you need to adjust for belt length. So that one's good. You can now slide the belt on and off without having to worry about it. And we have this one out of there too. So if you need to, you can take the whole belt out in just a few seconds, pop a new one in. You'll thank me later, I promise you. So hopefully that made your life a lot easier for you Vortec and Paxton owners. Um, and if you need it, we actually offer the option of this little guy right here. This is the bolt that you need. Uh, it's the correct length and thread pitch. It's a grade eight bolt with a super thick grade eight washer. So we offer it on the website. It's a Vortec quick belt change kit. So if you need it, it's there. It'll make your life easier if you go ahead and install it now before you have to change that belt.